Hi babes, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here. My name is Mary. I should be welcoming myself, girl, because it's been three weeks since I've uploaded. And girl, it's been a minute. Um, I've been doing other things. And as you can tell, my room is remodeled. Not remodeled, but I did paint it. And I did purchase a new neon light with my name on it. So let me move my big head so you can see it. I did switch my lighting, you guys, as well. As you can see, it looks completely different. I I'm going to be doing an updated room tour if you guys are interested. If you're not, well, I don't know what to tell you. But anyways, so for today's video, I am going to be doing this eye look using the Artist Couture Supreme Moths palette. I'm super excited, you guys, to um, be sharing a look with you guys. I did already use it. I did two looks with it. I didn't film because it was just something quick. I finally got to do a look and film it. So other than that, you guys, if you're interested in seeing how I created this look, just please keep on watching okay babe so i'm gonna go ahead and start off with the benefit 24 hour brow setter i don't like to fill in my brows until i am done with my shadow i don't know that's just me that's just how i like to do it i'm gonna start off with carving out my brows and i'm gonna use the Too Faced born this way concealer in golden beige i'm gonna be using my morphe and makeup by ariel a19 brush i'm gonna carve them out just so I can get that clean look, even though I don't have them filled in. I'm gonna go ahead and blend out that concealer using my Trixie brush. This is a concealer brush, this is a P10. What do you guys think about my background? I absolutely love my new light. I freaking love it. And I know the lighting is completely different because I have a new, a completely new light setup. I am not using my vanity mirror light anymore. That is the one I used to use to film my videos back then. So I feel like back then, but it's only been a month. But that's what I used to use to film my videos and I really loved the lighting but it was time for a change and I bought two new lights and of course I'm still using my ring light so by the way you guys I am also watching the Johnny Depp and Amber Heard trial I've been hooked on it today is a 19 and girl it's it's been really really good are you guys watching it too if you guys are watching it comment down below and let me know i am team johnny of course i feel like amber Heard just doesn't make any sense like she's definitely like a broken puzzle like and she just keeps on i feel like their lies after lies piling up and i feel like johnny i don't know i love johnny Depp. like i wouldn't picture him being that violin but anyways for eyeshadow base i'm gonna be using my mac painterly paint pot the shadows they don't crease on me you guys like when i use this paint pot okay babes now that i have my eyeshadow base i'm gonna be using my supreme my artist couture supreme moths palette and i do have fingerprints all over it if you watch my latest video which is my sephora haul i did show you guys a little more of this palette and i did use uh, some shades already and I have really been enjoying this palette so far. I'm gonna start off with hmm I'm gonna use Royale. I think that's how you say Royale or Royal. I don't know I'm just gonna use it with a uh, Morphe and Makeup by Ariel brush and I'm just gonna apply that onto the crease Okay, babe, so now I'm going to be using Prestige, this shade right here. And I'm going to be applying it with Morphe M456 brush. And I'm just going to apply it onto the outer corner. Slowly work my way up to the crease. It's blending on nicely. I am gonna go ahead and grab another brush you guys and this is another Morphe and Makeup by Ariel brush and I'm just gonna blend out that purple
Okay, babe. So now that I have that nice and blended, I'm gonna go ahead and use my. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and use Sex Appeal. This shade right here is such a beautiful. This is a pressed pigment, and I'm gonna apply it with my ring finger onto my lid. And oh my god, look how beautiful that is. This is stunning. So look at this shade. I don't think the camera is picking it up as well as how it looks in person, but oh my god, I freaking love it. And now I'm gonna go in with a Morphe M506 brush and I'm just gonna grab this pristine shade again and I'm gonna kind of like put those together. Just like that. Okay, babe, so I went ahead and did the rest of my face off camera. I did apply my lashes and I'm using Beauty Creations lashes in Daydream. And oh my god, you guys, I had so much trouble lip lining today. I just couldn't get it right. Um, I'm going to go ahead and apply some shadow underneath my under eyes. And I'm going to start off with Royal. So I'm going to apply some here. I also did apply a uh, brown eyeliner, you guys. Uh, I don't know which, I think it's LA Girl, but yeah, that's it. That's all I did. Okay, and now for my second shade, I'm gonna use Prestige, this one right here, and apply it to the outer corner. Okay, babe, so that is it for this eye look I created using the Artist Couture Supreme Moms Palette. I absolutely love this palette. If you're looking for a mom palette, I definitely recommend this one. Mac Daddy has done it again. This palette does retail for $45 and you can get it at Sephora or artistcouture.com. And yeah, you guys, that is it for this video. I really, really did miss filming. Let me know what you guys think about my background. Thank you so much if you did watch my video to the end. And don't forget to like this video if you did enjoy uh, this eye look and my vibe. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, girl. Help me reach a thousand subscribers. Uh, we're almost there. And I'm going to be doing a giveaway when I do reach a thousand. So yeah, you guys, that is it. Thank you so much. And I'll see you guys and girls in my next video. Bye.